I will not allow for your bangs to make you feel foolish. No, no. Every day I go to war with my bangs. Every day. So I know, I know the struggle. I know the pain, the frustration that your hair has put you through. Because my hair has done the same to me. You are in charge. You decide if you want your bangs to look good. Your bangs do not decide if you look good. You decide if your bangs will look good. Let me say it again. Your bangs do not decide whether it wants to participate or behave. You decide. I will not let your bangs disrespect you. I will help you put your bangs in its place. You will prosper. And you will have cute bangs by the end of this video. If the Lord permits it. Can you see the disrespect? My bangs must be going through a teen phase because they will not listen. I cut bangs, not a side bang. I have had enough and I know you have too. So here we go. Hi everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalie De Gracia, and I'm gonna help you train your bangs so that your bangs do not make you feel like an idiot. Because you are not an idiot, but your bangs sometimes like to make you feel that way. So, first off, what you're going to need is you're going to need a hair tie. This is very very important also what's useful for me is to get a brush that's about this size so just basically a brush that looks like this that has a lot of bristles so literally if i take a shower and then fall asleep and i wake up my bangs typically always look like this uh just basically a mess and just flying everywhere doing whatever it wants to do so the first step that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to part your hair the way that you parted your hair when your bangs were cut. So here I go. And I just quickly give it a little brush. And this um, method that I use doesn't take long at all. I will time it so that you guys can see how fast it works for me. And I hope it will do the same for you guys because I know what it feels like when your bangs are just frustrating you and you have to be somewhere. Next step is to find your bangs. Where are they? Literally, they're being so rude right now. What I do to find my bangs is obviously, first step is to part my hair. And my bangs are already being rude by messing up my part. But I kind of pull my hair back like this. And I kind of just shake my head. <laughs> it sounds silly, but it kind of works for me. <laughs> and I kind of brush through the little pieces that flew out. Obviously because my bangs are shorter than the rest of my head. So I'm going to set a timer. Okay. To show you guys what I do to make sure that my bangs are going to fall forward and not split. You know how sometimes bangs can do that awkward split in the middle? Especially if you just cut your bangs. This is how I forced my hair to not do that split thing. So here we have it. We have just a ponytail that is forward. So you're gonna look a little silly, but especially if you are running late, in the morning for school or for work or for anything um just put your bangs in a little ponytail in the front and then just do your makeup you can put on a headband like this pull it forward and then 
you just tuck your bangs like that to the side so that you, you can continue doing your makeup while your bangs are being forced to fall forward underneath the headband. So right now the time is two minutes and 13 seconds. Especially if it's your first time cutting your own bangs and you don't know where to start, you don't know why your hair is doing that weird thing. I would suggest putting your hair in this ponytail for about for as long as you can. The longer you have your bangs in this ponytail, the better. So here we are around the five minute mark and we're going to go ahead and take my bangs out of this ponytail. Let me give you guys a close up of my bangs. So I'm just pulling it off. Do you see how the rest of my hair is falling to the sides? And now my bangs here are falling forward with no splits in the middle, which is what we want. We want our hair to not split. And as you can see, my bangs aren't all to one side like it was or sticking straight up or straight out that way. But more or less, my hair is now to the front. So the next step is obviously to style your bangs. What I like to use is a straightener, okay? This is a Conair straightener. I got it at Walmart. It's, it's pretty good. It does the job. So now I'm going to take my straightener. I'm going to grab all of my bangs in one hand. Make sure not to burn yourself. I am using the lowest setting. I got this brush at my local H-E-B. I take my bangs. So I place my bangs into the straightener and I curl in. <gasps> and it gives me a little daisy may, a little daisy may bang. I literally look like I grow peaches in my backyard and I will make you the best sweet tea ever. There we are. So it literally takes me just one pass through to get my bangs to do what I want them to do. And then throughout the day, my bangs will fall a bit, but they are cut at a length where it won't cover my eyes once they fall. So that's how I like my bangs. And then my bangs look a little bit something like this. And yeah guys, this is what I do to make sure that my bangs are going to behave. So as you can see, the bulk of my hair is falling down to the sides and my bangs are falling forward, which is what we want. I use this hair tie technique every single day, babe, because with bangs, you just never know. I hope this works for you guys. I hope this works for you too, because I would be really sad if it doesn't work for you. Comment down below if this technique worked for you. I definitely want to hear from you guys. I hope this is going to fix someone's bang crisis. Because the last thing we need is for you to be freaking out and your hair to be looking cray. We don't need that, okay? That's going to be it for this video. I hope I helped you out in some way. I love, love, love you guys so much. Thank you so much for subscribing. We're almost at 3,000. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's free. It's literally me inside your phone or your laptop screen. And yeah, don't forget to follow my social medias if you want to. Bye guys. Ah. I have bangs and they behave.